Welcome to Cute eLearning Channel. In this lecture, we will discuss the Microbiologically Influenced Corrosion MIC. Description of Damage Corrosion caused by living organisms such as bacteria, algae, or fungi. It is often associated with the presence of tubercles or slimy organic substances. Often, the bacteria produce localized corrosion in the form of pitting or crevice corrosion. Affected materials most common materials of construction including carbon and alloy steels 300 and 400 series stainless steel aluminum alloys copper alloys and some nickel alloys titanium appears to be highly resistant critical factors Microbiologically influenced corrosion is found in aqueous environments. Stagnant or low flow conditions allow and or promote the growth of microorganisms. Organisms can survive and grow under a wide range of conditions including lack of oxygen, light or dark, high salinity, pH range of 0 to 12, and temperatures from 0 degrees Fahrenheit to 235 degrees Fahrenheit. In leakage of process contaminants, such as hydrocarbons or hydrogen sulfide may lead to a massive increase in biofouling and corrosion. Affected units or equipment. Microbiologically influenced corrosion is often found in water cooled heat exchangers, in the bottom water layer of storage tanks, in piping with stagnant or low flow, and in piping in contact with some soil. Fire water systems can be affected. Microbiologically influenced corrosion is commonly found in equipment where the hydro test water has not been removed or where equipment has been left outside and unprotected. Appearance or morphology of damage MIC corrosion is frequently observed as Localized pitting under deposits or tubercles that shield the organisms. Damage is often characterized by cup shaped pits within pits, the halo effect in carbon steel or subsurface cavities in stainless steel. Prevention Mitigation Systems that contain water, cooling water, storage tanks, etc., should be treated with biocides, such as chlorine, bromine, ozone, ultraviolet light, or proprietary compound. Periodically flushing and cleaning susceptible systems. Minimize low flow or stagnant zones in water containing systems. A flow rate of 3 foot per second will inhibit colony formation and thereby minimize the likelihood of microbiologically influenced corrosion. Empty hydro test water as soon as possible. Coating and cathodically protecting underground structures and Interiors of storage tanks have been shown to be effective mitigation methods for microbiologically influenced corrosion. 
inspection and monitoring. In cooling water systems, effectiveness of treatment is monitored by measuring biocide residual, microbe counts, and visual appearance of the water. Special probes have been designed to monitor for evidence of fouling that may precede or coincide with microbiologically influenced corrosion damage. Remote field testing can be performed to gauge depth of corrosion on heat exchanger tubes. Foul smelling water may indicate biological activity. Related mechanisms Cooling water corrosion Brine corrosion Oxygenated water corrosion and concentration cell corrosion. Summary Description Microbiologically influenced corrosion is a form of corrosion caused by living organisms such as bacteria, algae, or fungi. It is usually observed as localized pitting under deposits or tubercles that shield the organisms. Damage is often characterized by cup-shaped pits within pits in carbon steel or subsurface cavities in stainless steel. Temperature range Temperatures from 0 degree F to 235 degree F and pH range of 0 to 12. Affected metallurgy Carbon and low alloy steels 300 and 400 series stainless steel Aluminum, copper, and some nickel base alloys Prevention Treated with biocides Periodically flushing and cleaning Coating and cathodically protecting underground structures and interiors of storage tanks. Inspection methods. Measuring biocide residual, microbe counts and visual appearance. Using special probes the bioprobe is used to collect samples of bacteria in oil and gas. RFTVTAUT or RT. Practice time. Question number one. Which are the metals prone for MIC? Answer is D. Question number two. MIC is usually observed as Answer is D. This lecture is prepared by Samir Saad and this is his profile. Thanks a lot for watching and please waiting us for the next lecture.